Okay, kids, it's time for Get High School. So take off your thinking caps and put on your smoking jackets. Everyone knows when you smoke pot, you get high, unless you got ripped off. But just how does marijuana work? Actually, it's a complex process involving hundreds of chemical reactions. First, the THC, which stands for the high causer. This is from a book. First, the THC must enter the bloodstream, which when smoked enters through the lungs, which when eaten enters through the stomach, which when snorted just fucking hurts. Do not recommend them. Once in the bloodstream, the THC acts like a little stony salmon and has to swim upstream into the brain. Inside the brain, there are receptors that are very sensitive to cannabinoids. It's a funny word, huh? Receptors. <laughs> These pot-friendly receptors are identified by their patchouli-like smell. A lot of them drive old vans. They send the THC throughout the nervous system that causes a euphoric effect that is commonly referred to as being stoned, which is not to be confused with having, you know, rocks chucked at you. That'll also fuck you up. On rare occasions, some people sad, unfortunate people have a bad reaction to smoking weed. One young person told her cautionary tale to Jane Magazine, and they printed a line from her story on the cover. Pot made me jump out a window and bite a dog. <laughs> now, <laughs> I never actually got around to reading the whole article because there is no way that it could be funnier than this one sentence. <laughs> That's got to be some fucking good weed, though, I tell you that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to ask my pot dealer if he can get a hold of any of that dog biting shit that I heard about. <laughs> it's got to be good. Hey, uh, Doug. Yeah? Why are you buying Jane Magazine? <laughs> Oh, for the 25 hot hair and makeup tips. Oh. Would you like to borrow it? Yeah, I could use it. Yeah, you help. would. That's right. Yeah, 